You wanna go check out the museum? Are you kidding me? Have a good night. I don't like art. Hey, Jason. Hello? Up here, Jason. Ah! John Baldessari? What do you know, Jason? Well, I just dropped my friend off. He's going into a museum, but I don't like museums. You no, know, maybe there would be something there for you to take a look at. I mean, with all due respect, there's not. I mean, the second you go in there, it takes you 10 hours to get back out. Yeah, that's a tough one. I have no sense of direction. I, mean, I always have to ask how to get out of that place. I have a good sense of direction. I know that I'm going that way. Bye. Up here, Jason. I, I, I know where you are. Look, I don't know why you're following me. Maybe it was that piece of cheese I had last night. Metaphorically, if you give some kids some gorgonzola cheese, they're going to spit it out. What are you talking about? But if you give them some Velveeta, they say, mmm, yummy. And then maybe, you know, when they're young adults, they're really going to savor gorgonzola cheese. And yeah. art's like that. I, I know you're saying a lot of great stuff to me, but I feel like it's all being wasted. I cannot believe I'm talking to a wall. Dismembered parts have been kind of a subject in art. Look, is that Ed Ruscha? <laughs> I've always been interested in parts of things. Not following me! Why are you just a big head? I prefer getting people disoriented. <laughs> I think of myself like a detective novelist. I really believe art comes out of boredom. Hey! Oh my god. What are you doing? <laughs> What's the matter? Would you like some cheese? No, I like no. anything but gorgonzola. Why are you saying that to me? What's wrong with you, man? It's a joke. Who are you talking to? Really, don't judge me for this. I don't I'm know what to do. I'm a judgmental guy. Go. Do you know who John Baldessari is? Yes. John Baldessari's face has been following me. Not I know I body. said I wouldn't judge, but that's. Are you judging me? I am a bit. I'm serious. I need help. Are you being totally serious? Stay with me for another hour. You'll see what I'm talking about. Are you telling me you don't see that? You don't see John Baldessari? Probably I should go to a psychiatrist. I should probably go to a psychiatrist. <laughs> He's up there right now? He's right there. All right, you want to get some good perspective? I am not hearing and seeing John Baldessari. You get a master artist in your head telling you things. You've been freaked out by it, when to me, that's calming. All right? OK. You win. For whatever reason, I guess it's you and me tonight. Thank you. Why don't we take a walk and you can tell me a little bit more about yourself. Let's go to the end of this wall. Let's go. I'm trying to understand this. He just starts dripping paint on the canvas, and then it's like art? Yeah, yeah absolutely. You know what? I hate to be a contrarian, but it is a pipe. <laughs> Cubism is showing all the angles at one Moment? That's impossible. You know, it's it's not lukewarm stuff. I mean, it's great stuff. So the impressionists are saying it's an impression from the inside out. And then tell me how it gets to the furry spoon. I, or did I get that? Or is that wh which way is it, John? I can remember very clearly seeing Moni on his Broadway boogie woogie at the Whitney, and I cried. Yeah, it was so beautiful. So I've just never had a reaction to art like that. I didn't know you could react like that. Well, not you know. Boo hoo hoo, but you know, a couple of tears didn't run down my cheek. Guess what I've realized is I'm afraid. What if I go inside the museum, look around at all the art, and I just don't get it? I think the best thing is not to be intimidated. And if you don't like something, uh, you just say, I don't like it. That's fine. Art should be fun. All right. Thank you. Ah, come here. Put it here. I'm gonna go in and look at some art.